Well, all this week we have been taking action for you, giving you some helpful ways to stay organized and also save money. This morning we introduced you to a personal organizer with some simple tips and tricks to staying on track in 2020. Organizing tends to be kind of a, a scary thing. If getting your junk drawer together is your worst nightmare, Danny Brom says you're not alone. So this is and the solution free, to that could be somewhere around your house. I love using iPhone boxes because they make the perfect compartments for all of that stuff. Compartmentalize everything. So if you go to the dollar store, you can buy little trays that will subdivide this drawer into sections and then everything has a home. Brom also suggests finding free trays. Free this one was from a stamp set our kids got for the holidays. But maybe you've got bigger fish to fry in the kitchen, like your fridge. Brahm says start by making zones for everything. I love using these acrylic bins in the fridge because they keep similar items together. You can even use a label at the front. So this we've labeled lunches. Or maybe the bathroom makes you cringe every time you walk in trying to find your hairbrush. So we've got bobby pins. I like to use little bags to keep those all contained. One of my favorite hacks ever for hair elastics that always get lost at home, use a carabiner clip. Now to the bedroom. Maybe you're running out of space in the closet. You can fix that with a quick run to the dollar store and hang your clothes on. Don't ever guess, shower hooks. So this is just a 12 pack of shower hooks and this came from the dollar store, so 12 for a dollar. And we have all of these um, camisole shirts hanging on an over the door hanger. So if you have no space left in your drawers or you have no space left on your closet rods, this is a great way to add space. And if you're looking for the cheapest solution on the planet. Just going through and kind of figuring out what you want and what you don't want. You don't really need to buy anything to declutter. Set a timer for 15 minutes and really focus on that one area, not the whole room. Brom says organizing your house is way easier when you look at it as a habit instead of an event. Being organized, I really do believe can change your life. And if you're looking for more tips on organizing your house from Danny Brom, we have a few extra tidbits and videos showing you how to do it on our website. Just find this article on abcactionnews.com.